All right, I don't <clears throat> really uh, know what to do to make it any clear. I'm just, I'm just um, sharing what the Lord reveals to me and hoping and praying that people take it seriously and that people repent and turn from their sins. Um, that's my, that's my, uh, my hope and my prayer. That's what I, that's what I desire. But this is Daniel 9, 27. Okay. And he shall confirm the covenant with many for one week. And in the midst of the week, he shall cause the sacrifice and the oblation to cease. And for the overspreading of abominations, he shall make it desolate, even until the consummation. And that determined shall be poured upon the desolate. Nations invited for animal sacrifice on Mount of Olives, renewing Noah's covenant. Renew covenant. Covenant. Daniel 9.27 We are, this is going to happen on 9-25 through the 27. 9-27 is when this covenant will happen. Daniel 9-27, and he shall confirm the covenant with many for one week. They're getting nations together, and they're going to sign things that talk about the enforcing the Noah, or bringing about the Noahide laws again. Do you know what happens when you break the Noahide laws? In the section of laws before Sinai, the 1906 Jewish Encyclopedia states that with few exceptions, the breaking of the Jewish Noahide laws is punishable by death, by decapitation. Yes, the sword is coming, you guys, and um, he was spiritually uh, a, a sword. Abba brought a sword in that sense. But in the end times, the people who believe and follow Jesus Christ, many of them get decapitated. That's truth. It's in the Bible. That's how one of the greatest harvests is, is going to come in of sainthood in the kingdom. This is what happens when you break the Noahide laws. Am I saying that this is going to happen right after? No, I'm just saying that they're implementing this. The people who believe and accept Jesus as their Messiah, Lord, King, and Savior, the other people who are, again, who are, who are going to be decapitating people are thinking that they're worshiping the God of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob as well. But they don't accept Yahushua HaMashiach which is Jesus Christ. So I don't know. I'm, I'm telling you a sword is coming. Yes, it has been a spiritual sword, but it's, it's going to be a physical sword too. And once something bad some, or something major happens very, very soon, then they will probably start to implement the and, and put into and, and reinforce these Noahide laws because there's going to be great spiritual signs going on. Love you guys.